Yeah, you saw that title and thumbnail. I have to make this. Jake Paul is going to sleep Mike Tyson tonight. And uh, I was going to make this yesterday, but I just needed to roast Jones more times. I'm done with that now until 309 is over and this whole weekend's over. So I got to break this down before it happens. Jake Paul, he's going to beat Mike Tyson. And um, it hurts me. It really does just hurt me inside. All right, it hurts me that Mike Tyson's going to go out cold today. And it's not even that yeah, he's fighting guys like, like another legend, like a, a Vander Holyfield in a trilogy. It's against Jake fucking Paul. And um, should, I th- should this fight happen? No, it shouldn't. Is it fair? No, it isn't. Jake Paul. He's going to KO him brutally. And I hate it. And I'll, re- I'll give you the reasons why he will KO Mike Tyson. This might be like an 11 to 12 minute video. But I'm just going to give you my kind of bit of a last minute detail pick. But not really. More so a prediction video. But Jake Paul is going to win. He's going to go out there. And just... I'm worried, man. And, uh, yeah, we can all pray for Tyson. But I ain't gonna fucking... He's not gonna win. Now he could go out there and KO Jake Paul, and I'll even roast myself. You guys don't have to... Oh, let's go to Nubby's MMA video, and let's roast him now about this prediction. Don't fucking matter. Don't worry. I'll fucking roast myself. But I have to say the truth, guys. Jake Paul logically should win this fight now. I get it. Tyson's above him in the polls everywhere. And I get it. This is a really emotionally invested matchup. It fucking really is. But this is what's going to happen. Jake Paul's going to go out there. See what Tyson has early for him. Tyson's going to come charging there and early in this fight. And it's just not going to go well. He's going to get tagged. Like, I can see Paul just keeping his range early. His jab on Tyson. Well, Tyson, uh, like, bops around. Kind of dodging some jabs. And then Paul's going to land, like, a big shot over the top. Like he did against Mike Perry. And I get it, it's Mike Perry. But still... Still, Jake Paul has got, and I'm going to have to just be honest here, he's got wicked power. And he's, as far as I know for now, maybe it will get tested today. He's got an insane chin as well. I'm not a fan of Jake Paul. I respect him. Like his, like I respect, um... His, like, intelligence for a box for a sport of boxing. He knows all the champions. He knows this way and that way. Anything else, though? Fuck Jake Paul. <laughs> I'm just going to be honest with you guys. I am rooting for Mike Tyson. But he isn't going to win. He's going to get badly slept. And, um... It's not going to go well for him. I'm sorry, it just won't. Jake Paul is 27 years old. On all the roids he can get. Marks all over his fucking face. But again, this is Jake Paul's whole thing. So nobody will catch him for it or call him out for it. I know I just did, but still. no one will. He won't get any consequences for that. Tyson's probably on something as well. But it's going to benefit more of Jake's health. Like, Prime. He's not even in his prime. He's not even, like, in his 30s yet. And Mike Tyson's nearly fucking 60. It's tough to see this. It really is tough to see this. And I hate it. Because I want Mike Tyson to win. But it just isn't going to happen, is it? Jake Paul's going to go out there. 
and obliterate him. And I don't want it to happen, but Mike Tyson has never been known for his chin. It's not like Mike Tyson has a Canelo Mexican chin. Boom, can take a shot off the chin. Doesn't have that GGG chin, triple G chin. I don't know why I said it like that. He doesn't have that triple G chin, Kennedy Golovkin chin. Boom, took a shot Canelo. Mike Tyson can be, if he gets tagged bad, he can go down. And he has been down before. And Jake Paul, I know it's Jake Paul, but he's a decent boxer. And I know everyone after this, I know before this, everyone's going to be like, Tyson's going to whoop him, bro. After this, he'll just be, oh, he's 60 years old nearly. He's nearly 60 years old. You beat fight a real boxer. You know, and it's just... Yeah, I would like to see that, but like... I just don't see Tyson winning this. And I, I've been voting him in every poll because I'm emotionally invested as well. But I just don't see it. I don't see it. Tyson's good at blitzing and maybe Jake Paul gets overwhelmed in this fight. I just don't see it. Like, I just don't see him... Putting Jake Paul out cold. I know Jake's been tagged, but he's taking shots. Tyson's... Tyron Woodley's always had a decent... Woodley actually has been a bit weirdly suspect in the chin. But, you know, he put away Tyron Woodley out cold. I know it's Woodley, but still. I know I have to say, oh, it's Woodley, though. But still, in a past prime Woodley, I get it. He beats Nate Diaz, drops Nate Diaz... He beats Anderson Silva. And these are guys that will get back up. I know these guys aren't usually known for getting dropped, but... Well, Silva... Silva doesn't really... I think Uriah Hall did drop him at the end of his career, but still. Nate's not really known for getting dropped. He gets back up. These guys do get back up, but I can just see Tyson just going out. Just badly, and it's just depressing, and he loses, and it's just, I I hate this fight, but I have to tune in. I wish I could just ignore this, and just, okay, then we'll watch Jones versus Miocic, and Charles, oh, Charles Chandler, fuck! This is a really, this is going to be a really tough weekend, let's just get to Sunday, guys. Still, Jones Stipe, though, I'm... I'm fine that with that, because if Jones wins, I got my pick correct, and if he loses, then I'm fucking happy. But Charles Chandler is also a really annoying one, and this one as well. Tyson's going to win. Tyson's going to go out there and get the job done. No, no, no. I hope so. I'm sure everyone hopes so, but he won't. Jake Paul's going to go out there and get it done in round one. I think so. I think he puts Mike Tyson out in a round, and I think if it goes to later rounds, guys... Mike will fatigue. He'll get tired. Jake's going to invest the body. He's got good body shots, Jake Paul. Broke down Mike Perry and finished him. I know it's Mike Perry, but he, the king of violence of BKFC. I know it's a different sport completely, but it's still punching. But punching isn't boxing. That's what we saw in that fight. So whoever picked Mike Perry there is dumb. But still, Jake Paul's going to win. Jake Paul's going to win this fight. It's sad. I completely get it. But he's going to win. He's going to win. You know he will. Deep down, guys. Like, you know Jake Paul's going to... Oh, shit. Tyson could just get put out. And I had a dream the other day. That Tyson went... I had a dream about Jake Paul, Mike Perry. Uh, Mike, Mike... Not Mike Perry, but... Mike Tyson. I had a dream that... Jake kind of got stunned and was kind of like wobbly a bit, but kind of stayed in there. And Jay- and Mike went down and Mike, everyone was saying, get up, Mike. Get up. When he was on one knee. I really don't. I really hope that's just. I know people say dreams turn into reality. It just doesn't. It just doesn't. But still, maybe I'm going to be wrong about there now. Maybe my dream will be tell. Maybe my dream will just. Give me karma because I just said that. But still, I don't think it is. All right. I'm going to go with, um, 
I'm gonna go Jake Paul. Round one KO. I just he's got the reach advantage, he's younger. On all the roids. Mike Perry. Mike Tyson's not gonna. Why do I keep saying Mike Perry? Fuck off. Mike Tyson. He's gonna win. He's gonna lose. Sorry. Fuck, I'm just getting. I'm just messed up now. Now I just fucking mentioned that. Mike Tyson's gonna lose. He's 58 years old. This is a grandpa fighting. Going in there and fighting Jake Paul, who's a roid freak. He's going to lose. Tyson's going to lose. Like, subscribe. I'm going to go Jake Paul. First round KO. Uppercuts are there. Overhands are there. Hooks are there over the top. Jab one-twos are there. Straight shots are there. Body shots are there to invest in Tyson. If Tyson wins this, man, I'll be fucking happy. And I'll be fucking happy. If Tyson, Charles, and Stipe win, this world's fucking awesome. If two of them win, it's still awesome. But whatever. Shit happens. We can't get all three. If one of them win, I'm grateful. If, they, if none of them win, if Tyson, Charles, and Stipe all lose, which I think two of them will, one of them will, Charles Oliveira's going to win. Then if they all lose, then this world's fucking shit. Like and subscribe. Thank you for watching. I got Jake Paul. First round KO. Unfortunately. Plus, I feel like Tyson... He slapped Jake Paul the way in hard. I think Jake's going to be more, like, more fueled. And I feel like that'll benefit him, unfortunately. We'd love to just say no and pick Tyson, but... Gotta say the truth. Like and subscribe. Thank you for watching. I got Jake Paul. Over Mike Tyson. Hate those words. Why is that reality? Jake Paul will beat Mike Tyson. Fuck. Whatever. Peace.